Hi, I'm Randy Vance. Today I get to test Charger's 2230L Bay Boat. Now this Bay Boat has plenty of power with Mercury's Verado 300 horsepower outboard, and it's got great sea keeping capability because it's got really deep freeboard. Now I like the way the helm station is set up. It's got plenty of room to add the electronics that you prefer. You've got a grab rail all the way around for easy stand-up driving and a protective windshield. You've got digital switches over here and Mercury electronic throttle and shift and Mercury's electric steering. There are rod holders integrated on the sides, three on each side, so that you've got stand-up rod holders for your rigged rods. Now I like the traditional flop back cooler. It's a 90 quart cooler with a cushion on top and the back flops forward so that you've got an aft facing seat when you're trolling. Now the aft fishing deck has fold away seats on it so you've got more seating options for your passengers. Still, you can walk on it and you've got a great casting platform. On the port side, you've got a bait well. On the starboard side, you've got dry storage and the center hatch gives you access to all the plumbing in the bilge. The jump seats fold forward to reveal more dry storage. At the center of the deck is a plate for a casting chair. Forward on the console, you've got a thick cushion and seat back. You lift the lid and you've got a large bait well that's aerated and recirculated. Now there's a nice step up on either side of the casting deck and once you're up here, you've got a very large area from which to fish. On the port side, you've got a rod organizer in this locker. On the starboard side, you've got a dry locker there. Central, this is an insulated cooler or a fish box if you want to use it that way. We've got an anchor locker forward, so if you're bottom fishing, you've got all the anchor and road that you need. This boat is also set up with the Minn Kota Tarova trolling motor, and the three batteries for it are located under the center console. There's also a plate for a casting chair on the foredeck. And if you buy that optional chair, it's what a lot of tarpon fishermen use for a fighting chair. The boat comes equipped with a raw water washdown and a battery selector switch. For added performance, opt for the Bob's jack plate. Gives you extra shallow draft and a better running angle. Now the Doris family has been building quality bass boats and bay boats, high performance boats at that, for decades. That single family continuity assures that you're going to get the most fun from your Charger 2230L bay boat. I'm Randy Vance.